In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a Facebook access token so that you can display your Facebook events using the Smash Balloon Facebook Feed Pro plugin. To display your Facebook events using the plugin, you need your Facebook page ID, an event access token, and the event's iCal URL. First up is your Facebook page ID. Just head to your Facebook page, click on About. Next, click on Page Transparency, and your Facebook page ID will be displayed here. Just copy it and enter it back inside the plugin. Next, let me show you to obtain your Facebook event access token. The first thing you should do is navigate to the documentation page on smashballoon.com for how to create a Facebook events access token. You can find a link for it in the description of this video. This documentation will walk you through all the steps of obtaining your Facebook events access token. And under step number one, it says go to developers.facebook.com. You can click the link on this page or you can find a link for it in the description of this video. Now on developers.facebook.com, you can go ahead and log into your Facebook account or if you don't already have one, create a new account. Once you've logged in, go click on My Apps on the top right corner. Next, on the right hand side, click on Create App. And on this menu, you can select Other at the bottom and click Next. Now it's asking us to select an app type. Since we want to view Facebook events, we want to select this one here, which is Business. So you can select it and click Next. Then we can give our app a name. I'm going to call it Smash Balloon Events, just like this. Underneath that, you can add your app contact email. I'm going to leave it as is. And underneath that, you can also select the business account associated with your events. But for this tutorial, I'm going to leave it as default and click Create App. Now our app has been created and on the left hand side, you can expand app settings and click on Basic. On this page, you can find your app ID and your app secret. Copy your app ID and head back to the documentation page on smashballoon.com. Navigate to step number three and if you scroll down, you can find the step that we're on right now, which is to copy your app ID. You can copy and paste your app ID in the box below like this. Now we can head back to Facebook to get our app secret. Hit this one right here so we can click on Show and copy it just like your app ID and paste it in the second box on the documentation page, just like this. Once that's done, click on this link over here for step number four. This is where we'll create our access token. Under Meta App, you can expand it here and select the app that we just created, which is Smash Balloon Events. And at the bottom under Permissions, there's three we need to add. You can type it in here. And the first one we need to add is page underscore events, this one here. The next one is pages underscore read underscore user content. And the last one is pages underscore read engagement, these three. Once that's done, you can click on Generate Access Token. You'll see this window pop up on your screen ask you to confirm if this is your Facebook account. Make sure you're logged into the correct account and click Continue at the bottom. Next, between these two options, make sure you've selected Opt-in to Current Pages Only and you can scroll down and find the Facebook page you want to source your events from. For us, it's this one here. We can select it and click Continue. And lastly, we can click Save at the bottom and click on Got It. And just like that, we have our Access Token ready to go. We can copy it and paste it on step number 13 of the documentation page. After pasting it, click the button on the right-hand side to extend that token. It's really important to do this as the original token will expire. We can copy it and paste it back inside the plugin, just like this. And lastly, let me show you how we can get our event's iCal URL. To find your URL, first navigate to Facebook and make sure you're logged into the account you want to display your events from. And on the left-hand side, click on Events. And at the top, click on Your Events. This should display all the upcoming Facebook events for your Facebook page. On the top right corner, you'll notice an Add to Calendar button. You can right click on it and click copy link address. Now head back to the plugin and paste that URL here like this. And that's it. And once that's done, you can proceed to create your fast, responsive, and beautiful Facebook events feed like this. If you have any questions or are experiencing any technical issues, please contact our awesome support team. They'd be happy to help you out. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.